Hey guys, Abhi here from VIP Well Studio. So in this video, we'll be learning about CDNs. How can you get a free Cloudflare CDN? What are the advantages of using a CDN? CDN basically is called Content Delivery Network. All right. So if we look at the world map, uh, we can see a lot of sports in here. All right. Now imagine this is your website server. All right, Let, let's put it in the United States. All right, so this is your website server. This is where you hosted your website. And one fine day, uh, due to some reasons, the network reach to this particular server was lost. What happens? Every access to your website is lost. Now, no one will be able to access your website. No one will be able to, you know, get details from your website uh, completely down. Now, how can a content delivery network help you in such cases? Content delivery network like Cloudflare, they'll be having lot of servers spread around the world, like all these slots. All right. And you'll be having a main server like this. And what Cloudflare does is that they will be keeping a cached copy of your website, not the entire website, but a cached copy. They have a buffer size. For free accounts, it will be low, but still it's worth it. So they'll be having a cache version of your website and they will be storing it in various servers around the world. So if one server goes down, they can access it from the nearest server. And let's say I am accessing from India right now. I do not have to go through the cables all the way to United States to access my website. I have the nearest CDN available. I can directly access from the CDN server in India. So that saves a lot of time. Now, if you read Google blogs, you definitely know Google is really, really concerned about page speed. So if you can upgrade your page speeds, that would be really great for your SEO. So always try to improve your page speed. There are a lot of ways to improve your page speed. You can use caching plugins in your hosting. You can use a uh, content delivery network. You can use VPS servers, lot of options. So Cloudflare is one of their options. Now I'll be showing you how to configure Cloudflare for your hosting. All right. So as you already know, the domain of YouTube channel is VIP dot studio. All right. So if I visit VIP dot studio, it will take me to a page like this. And my name servers are a two hosting name servers. As you might have already figured out, a2 hosting is the hosting which I use. I love that hosting the support and speeds especially are comparatively higher, far better than HostGator or GoDaddy or mainstream hosting providers. I really love A2 hosting. So anyway, uh, I have the A2 hosting name servers set for my domain. All right. So I highly recommend you set it before you go and add your website in Cloudflare. All right. So if you add it before setting up your name servers, it is going to make things complicated. So I want you guys to add the name servers before you click on the ad site in Cloudflare after you sign up. All right. So once you are in Cloudflare, you can click on ad site, which will take you to a page like this in here, enter your domain name, click on begin scan, which will scan the entire websites of domain records. All right. So it will take some time. I'm going to pause the video and come back when the scanning is complete. All right. So the scanning is complete. Once the scanning is complete, you can click on continue setup, which will list all your domain records, which Cloudflare obtain from the domain. All right. So if you are sure of adding domains at this place, sorry, adding name servers at this place, you can do that. Uh, if you're not very sure of what you're doing, I recommend do not do anything in here. All right. So once you verified everything, you can click on continue, which will take you to a new page where you have to select the plan. Now you can select the pro or business website plan. If your website is getting a lot of visits and you like to, you know, really get the best out of Cloudflare, but you can of course stick with free website if you want. And that's not bad. Actually for small website, 
the free website plan is pretty good now uh, I can select free website and click on continue which will take me to a new page where it will show what to do with the existing name server so currently I have four name servers Cloudflare want me to change these name servers into the new name servers as shown in this page so I'm going to copy these two name servers and update my name servers in Namecheap now I didn't show you how you can update the name servers because most of you will be having different domain name providers all right no, domain registrars I use Namecheap which is very good and uh, you may have a different one so it may differ how you reach this page so you have to know how to update your name server so I'm going to update my name servers as Cloudflare want me to do and the last two name servers are to be removed so once I've uh, entered the name servers of Cloudflare I click on save which will save my name servers all right now I will click on continue which will update the Cloudflare database now you have a website here all right this will take up to an hour to you know uh, propagate the name servers and show this as accepted if the site is accepted it will show a green I'll be pausing the video and getting back to you when this turns to green color all right it will be only turning to green once the name servers are properly propagated all right I have waited for about 10 to 15 minutes and I refresh the screen to see a green line over here so the pending status is gone which means I am getting the Cloudflare service in my domain so the VIP wealth.studio this website is now actively passing through the Cloudflare system now I have an active CDN over here we don't see much changes because uh, uh, well it is not supposed to bring any changes to a website it is actually a performance upgrade all right now I'll be showing you how to set up a free SSL in your uh, domain name it's actually called flexible SSL this is not a very good SSL type to use all right now I have a video where I'll be showing you how to set up an SSL for free which is far better than this I really recommend you use that all right but if you are so particular in getting an SSL from Cloudflare I think I should show you this now let me show you what a flexible SSL is all right so this is flexible SSL the connection between user and Cloudflare will be encrypted the connection between server and Cloudflare won't be encrypted all right but if you want to get a real SSL for free which encrypts both Cloudflare and server you can follow the link right below this video where I'll be showing you how to set that up of course for free so for setting up a flexible XSL you have to click on crypto and in here you'll be seeing something like SSL all right from there you have to select flexible and that's basically it you are supposed to have an HTTPS on your domain so once you have done that you can click on page rules and you're supposed to add some page rules to use the SSL so for adding page rules you have to click on create page rule and in here you have to select add a string and from settings select always use HTTPS and in URL you're supposed to type the existing URL of your website now I'm going to add asterisks at the end of my URL and I'm going to add asterisks at the beginning of my URL this means I can have www and I can have any pages which follows this URL alright so you're supposed to add something like this and click on save and deploy now this is supposed to add an SSL certificate to your domain this SSL certificate is not actually recommended if you are using WordPress I've seen some issues with this SSL certificate but I just want you guys to know about the flexible SSL that is provided by Cloudflare even though I do not recommend using that so let's try visiting the website 
Now, currently, I am not able to get the SSL certificate. Actually, it will take about 24 hours to get the SSL certificate to a domain. So you have to wait if you're not able to get an SSL certificate. So this is Abhi Abraham from VIP Well Studio. Let me know what you think about a free CDN and flexible SSL. And please let me know uh, how did you enjoy the video? What are the changes you would like to have in VIP Well Studio in the coming videos? So speak to you soon. Thank you.